Welcome back to another For the Love of Dogs video. Uh, for this video, I am going to be showing uh, two different dogs uh, and how I blow dried them. Uh, one is a West Highland Terrier and the other dog is a Pomeranian. So just two different ways. Uh, if you were going to dry a Cairn Terrier or um, really any of those Terrier dogs, uh, you would dry them the same way, but just the head would be just a little bit different than the Westie head. Um, like a Westie head, you dry everything this way, whereas on a Cairn Terrier's head, you would dry everything going back that way. Um, <clears throat> and then a uh, Pomeranian, uh, to just show how I dry double-coated dogs to get all that undercoat out. And I will also talk about what products I used pre uh, prior to shooting the videos uh, so you guys can see that. And without further ado, here is that video. All right, so here's how to dry a Pomeranian. Uh, so I just towel dried her off real good. I, and then um, I used eye groom, keratin, leave-in conditioner on her. And so how I'm blow drying is I blow dry, I do real fast closer to the skin to get all the water out. And then I go just a little bit slower to get all of the undercoat out. And when I blow dry dogs' butts, I always pull their tail up under in between their legs so I don't accidentally blow dry their butthole and make them poop everywhere. Um, and then when I want to get, you know, all in between their legs, I'll just hold their tail out of the way and blow dry from underneath their body and stick it out back between their legs, if that makes sense. Um, and I had thoroughly brushed her uh, with a safari brush prior to starting blow drying her after I'd put the leave in and, and then I had brushed her all over everywhere uh, just to help with all that undercoat. And then I just go back and brush everywhere real, real good afterwards. And I always hold their ears closed uh, while blow drying around their ears and their head. Uh, so here, Westie, so I'm just gonna blow, uh, brush everything down and then blow dry down. You want their hair to be down. You don't want dips all over their hair. So I'm gonna blow dry real, real fast just to get the water off in some spots. And then I go back and I'm using a flat cone to help the air flow go directly down so that it's not getting dips all over the place. You want their skirt, everything to be flat down. So I'm just going to keep doing that and same thing like with the Pomeranian, I'm going to hold their tail down to do their butt and just keep going down and down and make sure when you're drying a Westie, sometimes they feel like they are dry but you need to stick your hands under their fur to make sure that it is fully dry. Um, and with their head you want to blow dry everything forward on the top of their head and then the sides of their face. Uh, this little girl is really old so I wasn't gonna you know try and force her too much but um, you want to blow dry their face going up and this is just the conditioner that I use and then the shampoo that I use which is great sulfate paraben free and pH balance for dogs and then this is the brush that I use to brush them before and after the bath and I will put links in the description to all of this.